All right, hey there, all you true crime junkies, myself included. There is a new special out this week. It surrounds the 2008 tragic death of two-year-old Kaylee Anthony, which shocked the nation and tore apart the Anthony family. Well, this Thursday, a two-hour telecast shows George and Cindy Anthony taking polygraph tests to respond to the accusations made by their daughter, Casey Anthony. And here to give us a look at how it all shakes out is host and journalist Tony Harris. Good to see you, my friend. Kristen, how are you? How's the fam? How are the girls? How's your hubby? <laughs> Everybody is doing great. Happy New Year to you. So good to see you and see you on this story. I love your reporting. What was it like to sit down with Cindy and George Anthony? It was it was a lot. It was it was extra. It was at times almost too much. Um, you know, they live in a small house in Florida and, and in the Orlando area and um, it, it's the house is kind of this memorial. It's not only to the family they had, but it's also to the family that they lost. It's 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 pictures everywhere of, of Kaylee, of Casey. Um, and it's just a reminder of, of what was for that family. And it, it's also pretty painful to think about everything they've lost. And, you know, in many respects, they're kind of a, a family tragedy and, and a broken family. But, you know, I, I, I hope at some point they can and they can get some solace and peace, but it's an ever present pain and, and agony for that family for for George and for Cindy. So um, it was it was really difficult. It took me a couple of days to sort of come out of that mode of, of being with them. Oh, I can imagine because, yeah, you spent like four days with them, right? Yeah, it was tough. It oh. was tough. And, you know, as you know, because, you know, you, you, you're a fan of, of the true crime world as well. Uh, when you're talking to people about the worst day and or in this case, days and months, uh, and years of their life. It's if you're not in that moment with them, you can't you can't really tell the story effectively. And that's always right. been my approach to get as, as close to it as I possibly can. And and that was the case in in this reporting. And at the end of it, I was I was I was pretty emotionally. Mm. Um, well, I, it took me a while to recover. Yeah. I'll just say that. <laughs> so we see George and Cindy sit down and do a lie detector. Is this what are we going to see from that part of it? Is this straight through? Like why a lie detector test? It, it was it was our attempt to figure out how to move a story that a lot of people knew the the right. the, the frame up and even the guts of the story. So it was our attempt to try to move the story forward. And um, the producers who did a wonderful job on this, uh, the, the production company is King and Wilder, and was happy to play my part. Um, it, it, they had taken at various times a lie detector test before. It was never really made public, I don't think. But this was an opportunity for them, and particularly for George, to sort of go on the record and, and to state his case as clearly as he could. And it was difficult for him to do that, as you'll see. And this thing un really sort of unfolds in real time. So. Uh, we do the bulk of the interview before he sits down to the lie detector test. And I should tell you that both George and Cindy take a lie detector test. Uh, we, we prefer to call it a polygraph exam. Mm -hmm. Our examiner, who was brilliant, calls it a polygraph exam. I'm happy with that as well. But we know that people think of it as a, a lie detector right. test. And uh, I think we wanted clarity to the extent that we could get greater clarity. And we, we, we sort of came together on the idea that a polygraph exam would do that. They mm -hmm. agreed to it which was amazing. Uh, I don't think you could ever get Casey to sit down to, I, I'm hoping I'm wrong about right. this. I don't think you could ever get her to sit down to do such an exam. Uh, but I think uh, we get some greater clarity on this story. Well, Tony, thank you for bringing this story to us. I know it was a lot of hard work, but if anybody can move a story forward, bring us some clarity, it's you. So good to see you. Always great to see you, Kristen. Uh, tell everyone I said hello. Will do. All right. Thank you so much, Tony. Again, you can watch the two-hour special, Casey Anthony's Parents, The Lie Detector Test, this Thursday on A&E.